Hey, Scorpios. It's the High Priestess doing your general tarot reading. It's general, so if it resonates with you. Y'all leave me some comments. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and tap the bell. Thank you. And make sure you click all for the notifications, okay? I don't feel like YouTube is like shadow banning me. Like they've been shadow banning me like for a minute. Hello. Help me out. Okay. Also, y'all check out the website for the manifestation candles. They on sale. 20% off for spring, okay? The candles are very powerful. The magician, the lovers, and the empress, the most three, the three most powerful manifestation cards of the tarot. So riddled with so much symbolism. And then they come charged like by me. So like, they're really, really powerful. Okay? If you follow me on my social sites, you can see the reviews. You can see my review. Hey Scorpios, two of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. Y'all is indecisive. Y'all indecisive about some things. I feel like some of y'all. I feel like you, you just feeling scattered. I feel like you feeling scattered all over the place. Don't know what direction to go. But the Six of Wands is here, so it's like whatever you decide to do, you going to be it's going to be success for you. So I feel like. Some of you could be nervous about making a decision, okay? It could be about a relationship. Some of you is about investments. Others of you is just about people in general. But I feel like go with what's your, your first instinct. Because I feel like some of y'all had a first instinct and then you start second guessing yourself. So I feel like whatever, but whatever it is you choose is definitely going to be successful. So go with, with the option that you want. Because I feel like you're trying to be indecisive. The Eight of Cups is here. And then the seven, Five of Swords I see. So some of you, it's about walking away, okay? Some of y'all indecisive, making a decision about walking away from a person, okay? Walking away from one person, though, I feel like to be with another. You ain't just walking away. It's like some of you is cutting somebody off to make something happen with someone else, okay? This Knight of Pentacles. So some of y'all, I feel like a person could have been waiting to be with you, to get with you. And you know it. And some of y'all just been indecisive. Like, oh, I don't like make indecisive about a person that's all over the place about you. Okay. So I feel like some of y'all is going to make a decision to, to walk walk away, which is five of sword is going to be victory for you. Okay. And you're going to get the knight in shining armor. Okay. You're going to get the one that was waiting for you. Okay. The one that's going to value you. Okay. Real love. Okay. Six of cup is here. Somebody really love y'all. So, and I feel like for some of you, you you know that a person, I feel like some of you, you torn between someone that you know is going to treat you right and someone that is like basically like a shadow to you that's not even there. Don't even value. Like they don't even really know you exist. Like don't even treat you like anything. And I feel like some of y'all is torn. It's the Ten of Swords and the Page of Pentacles. Some of y'all really need to focus and pay attention to what this person the, to the behaviors of this person. Pay attention to the past, present behaviors of this person and let it go. It's a tennis sword here. It's the end of this. Tennis swords is like back sat, like a person that just like, you done just been through so much. Like it's time for you to, to, to move on and get what you really deserve in life. Okay. Six of one again. Yes. Yeah, so somebody is definitely going to be successful. So I feel like some of you need to just make that decision. I feel like make the decision that you already, I feel like you already know what you want. You already know what you want. And for some of you, it's not even that you walking away from a relationship. It's like you, you tire of like all the relationships that didn't work. The people that you was given chances and they wasn't choosing you. You had to walk away for your own happiness. Okay. So I feel like it's coming to the end of even that cycle. Like, even if it's not a relationship, it's just like you want real love. You tired of being sick and tired. You tired of not getting what you want. You know what you want in relationships. And I feel like you are going to have what you want. I feel like you're walking, you're walking into success. So I feel like whatever decisions that you 
It's like, don't be confused about what it is that you want when it comes to, like, love either. And I feel like you're not confused. You know what you want, but you tend to, like, sometimes you could stay in a situation past the expiration date. Okay, the King of Cups, the Empress, the Tower, and the Page of Cups is here. So I feel like some of you, it's like, I feel like some of you, it's like, you could be torn because, like, you could know that a person love you and you love this person, but you know that they don't, they're not at the level that you want them to be. It's like you're wanting more in life. And I feel like that's, that's, I feel like sometimes that, that could be not enough. Like some of you are with a king of cups and you're an empress. It's like, they love you, but do they love themselves enough? It's like, they love you, but it's like, you know, it's not that love to give you what you want. So it's like, y'all both have love for each other, but you know, this person isn't at their height of heights. Like they still have some growing to do. They still have some, like, they still have some ambitions to it. Like, they're not ambitious. And so I feel like it's it's just not there. And it's not a match, okay? So some of you, you could be trying to, like, stick it, like, stick it out with a person that's just not your match. Like, you're more than them. You're an empress. This person is the king of cups. And then with the tower... Like, it could be, some of you could even have, like, good sex because the tower is Mars energy. You could be, like, sexually attracted to a person, but they're just not at your level as well. Like, y'all you, you could have good sex and emotionally he supports you, but financially it ain't there. It's something that's not there. So, for some of you, it could be um, financially there, but they're not emotionally supportive and that's not enough for you. So, take the energy how it resonates, but I feel like it's a tower. All in all, it's a tower. It's not going to work. Like, you're not with your match. So, I feel like some of you just, you you need to even get moving. And the Ten of Cups is at the bottom. So, you're definitely going to be, like, happy in love. Like, I feel like Scorpios ultimately, um, when y'all choose y'all partner, is out of, like, happiness. Like, I don't feel like y'all, like, y'all so much don't really be with people uh for like sexual and if it is they don't work out or last long okay so i really feel like it's uh some of you could be just focusing your energy on like that long lasting love okay yeah some of you is like some of you i feel like you even ready to walk away from a situation because it's not enough like passion in it i feel like some of you feel like it's not passion okay but it's just, again, the person is not your match. Like, they're not pa as passionate as you are because you're an Empress Energy and they're in King of Cups. So, it's like, again, not a match. So, I feel like some of you trying to, uh, could be trying to make it work or trying to, like, put flames out of, some, of, of something that is crumbling. The Nine of Wands, the Nine of Cups, the King of Wands, the Page of Wands, and the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, so I definitely feel like you're in a pursuit of, like, happiness. And I feel like you're starting to, it's like you're starting to pursue, like, long-term things. So, long-term investments. You're going after long-term goals. Like, long-term relationships. I feel like you... It's like you want what you want and that's what you're going after. I feel like you're just going after what you want right now. And with the nine of wands, I feel like for some of you, like you don't even care. Like you all in it for the fight. It's like you don't even care of the obstacles that's in the way. I feel like whatever it is that you want right now, I feel like you going after that. I feel like you determined to like really get what you want. And I feel like for the long term, and that's everything, everything like business, love, I feel like you Scorpios, you really going after what you want. So I feel like um, even if you are like entertaining someone that's not your long term person right now, you gonna walk away because you know what you want for the long term. So even if you entertaining it, you gonna walk away because you know what you really want, and you know some of y'all just know like you y'all wise anyway. You know that you know like you gotta kiss frogs to get your prince, or you know you gotta go through like the the rough to find your diamond. So I feel like y'all already know the. I see the three of pentacles here and the six. Look what I just said. This three of pentacles and six of swords. Like y'all willing to like connect with people just to see if they're your person and like if it's not like let them go. So I feel like for some of you it could be like um, 
hard to like let go of a person that you've been with for a while could be trying to patch it up but others of you i feel like you and the energy are really pursuing what you want so it's like you you willing to connect with like people and have like short flings just to meet your person so i feel like all in all like y'all still getting what y'all want the six of swords came out the deck and then the king of pentacles follow on so definitely like y'all heading towards financial stability um the stars here so i feel like for some of you you even about to be like a star or you're going to be recognized i feel like some of you yeah you really um uh, are standing out or about to stand out okay something you do is about to stand out and for some of you with that five lines it could create like a lot of like frenzy um jealousy or like competition okay and for some of you i feel like you just even have that you have like um i feel like that's a scorpio energy anyway y'all follow me on tiktok i said that in a video like wherever you, where scorpio is is where you have like secret haters and jealousy and i feel like y'all have that anyway like secret like competition because you shine so it's just like um yeah so like i feel like the spotlight is on you so it's going to be creating like that um that energy of people like in competition with you. And I feel like for some of y'all with this King of Pentacles, like you just be focused on like your own thing, your own like uh, financial stability, your own like partner, okay? And I feel like just doing your own thing in general. I really feel like you really be just like focused on like what it is that you wanna do. And Yeah, I feel like uh, you be so focused, like, just other, I feel like you focus on what you want to do. So, it could create just, like, people could just, like, want to watch you. So, I feel like for some of you, like, people just, like, watch your social media. Like, because you just so, like, I feel like for some of you, you just be in your own world. And, like, people is just, like, inquisitive as far as, like, what you be focused on, what you be doing. Okay? So, I that's the energy I'm feeling with y'all. I'm feeling like a lot of people could be watching y'all social media. And things like that okay because y'all shine i see the sun in the deck because y'all shine y'all shine like you naturally shine okay these cards flipped out the six of pentacles the emperor ten of cups two of wands queen of cups and the king of swords so yeah the emperor so the emperor is like it just fell so i definitely feel like yeah in a death card so y'all energy scorpio energy okay so, yeah, just being a true Scorpio, like, dead in situations that don't work out, I feel like. Also, I feel like with the Six of Pentacles and the Emperor, like, some of y'all, like I was saying, in the Ten of Cups, some of y'all is going to be getting y'all definite match. Like, so stop trying to make it work with your person, okay? You're, you, y'all, you have a match, okay? If you watching this, you have a match. Your Empress, your Emperor, you have, your other half is out there, Okay? You're meant to be happy. You're going to be in a happy relationship. So I feel like with this two of wands, the queen of cups, and the king of swords, you're just going to have to be like, you're just going to have to be prepared to like emotionally to deal with like different people. Like, and that's on an emotional level, on a mental level. Like you just want to have to have the mental and emotional toughness to continue with your path out here. Okay. Because I feel like you meant to find your person. Just keep going forward because you meant to be happy you meant to find your person okay because i feel like king and queen of cups is here it's like also but it's like you you're meant to be with your person okay and your person is going to be like nurturing and a provider and all these things that you're wanting okay so yeah and some of you i feel like yeah just watch your backs out here because you could have people trying to um Play on your emotional intelligence. Play on your intelligence. Play on your emotions. Or play on both. I feel like just watch your back. Watch your back out here, Scorpio. All right. So, I'm going to pull some situations for Scorpio. Closed in, trapped, frustrated. So, this lockbox. Closed in, trapped, frustrated. So, I feel like some of y'all is like, could be feeling like that in a relationship. Some of y'all could feel or could have felt like that in a relationship that you finally decide to like leave from. I feel like some of y'all is feeling like that. And some of y'all may feel like you locked in with a person and like you really not. 
okay? Retaliation, punish, payback, revenge, okay? Interview, talk, conversation, get on the same page. Legal court, paperwork, file. I already was feeling this um, legal action when I seen this punish, payback, revenge. I feel like for some of you, you had to... Some of you could be going through court because I also see scales with the emperor. That could be the judge. So for some of you, uh, you could be getting, maybe someone could be trying to get revenge for you for this court, this paperwork that you filed against them or something like that. For some of you, you could be getting like, uh, like compensated for this uh, court, um, for a court or whatever. You could be getting compensated. I feel like some of y'all is getting compensated with the six penalties. We getting a payout. And nightlife gamble, take a risk. Vegas. I feel like some of y'all even need to be careful. Like going out, um, going out. I feel like be careful going out. If you go out in a nightlife, be careful. If you know you dealing with anyone that may be like vengeful or want to pay you back in some type of way. Okay. Cause I feel like somebody is, is retaliation. Somebody want to retaliate against you and with interview, they could be, like um talking to people about you conversating um asking questions about you okay and for some of you with uh interview um talk and kind of some of y'all could be like trying to get on the same page with that uh person that you know is giving you a hard time that you probably should be like walking away from or choosing to walk away from you having a hard time deciding pop-up spontaneous unexpected surprise visit so I feel like for some of y'all, some of y'all could be like on probation. I feel like this lockbox trapped in. Some of y'all on probation, y'all going to get a, a pop-up visit from your uh, probation or parole officer, okay? I'm just telling you. That's what I feel. I see in the cards. And others of you, I feel like... Some of y'all might even just be getting like... um like a surprise visit from a person but i feel like it's a, it's a surprise is a pop-up visit so, so i feel like somebody from your past could be surfacing for some of y'all okay somebody that you had feelings for and you probably was playing a future and married with this person i feel like this person could unexpectedly like pop up but i really feel like it's it's for like closure okay so damn this reading went long scorpio see y'all 